morning guys happy Tuesday um, right now I'm running to Target because I want to get some cocoa because I have these little stencils that um, you can make like different little designs on top of your coffee and I was doing it wrong the entire time I looked it up um, over the weekend and yeah I've been pretty much doing it wrong the entire time so I'm gonna go to Target to grab some cocoa and I have to get my husband some beer butter and I could show you guys the beer butter because a lot of you guys ask me about um, my husband's beard well I guess your man tell you to ask me and um, on how he grooms his beard so I've told y'all before about that beer butter it smells amazing and it leaves his beard really soft and shiny so I'll show y'all that because he asked me to pick him some up since I was going to Target and um I'm going to the mall today, me and my homegirl. I think I'm gonna get um, some chai and see if I can make my own drink. So I'm gonna try this. stuff Tony's telling me it's by the shampoo but I don't see it oh, no I'm not overlooking it um, I don't see it anywhere this boy had me on the wrong aisle because here's the trimmers did they change the packaging? I, I think they changed the packaging a little bit. Let me um let me call Tony. Alright y'all. We're at the mall. Chelsea's here. Say hey, hey Chelsea. So we're going in Forever 21 and probably a few other places. So of course we'll show you guys what we pick up. Then we're going to Trader Joe's, see if we can find some cute little fall snacks. Y'all excuse my hair, cause I did something real quick and I didn't even flat iron it good, but let's go in the mall. I gotta put my mask on. Okay, y'all, so we're at this little antique shop. It's called Great American Antique Mall. So I'm gonna take you guys around. We're just out having a girl's day once again. <laughs> Living our best life. <laughs>
Okay, y'all, so we made it back home. And excuse the way I look, I don't have no lashes and that like that. Don't come for me. Don't come over here judging me. I done told y'all. <laughs> so, first of all, let me just say this. We walk in to the house and my son found a hundred dollars. Like a hundred dollar bill. Y'all yeah, look. My son is big big time child. He buying dinner tonight. And let me show y'all what I got from Trader Joe's. We decided not to get any of the pumpkin treats. We're gonna try that when we have more time. So, um, of course I picked up another bottle of jam jar. I have to grab a bottle of jam jar every time I go to Trader Joe's. And then I picked up some fettuccine Alfredo. I've never tried this one before, so I wanted to give this one a try. And then I love these crackers. Some people don't like it. If you don't like the flax seeds in your crackers, you won't like it. Tony hates them, but I think they're pretty good. Then I picked up a margarita pizza and a three cheese pizza. So I decided to try to make my own chai latte. So I bought some of this Tezo classic chai latte. I'm gonna try to make the pumpkin spice. I bought some cocoa. And then I bought this um, Myers Clean Day uh, Multi Surface Cleaner. This is the Acorn Spice, and they only put this one out during the holiday. It, this one smells really nice, so I grabbed this one. This is the beard butter that Tony uses. He gets it from Target, and it smells really, really nice, and it leaves his beard feeling real soft and shiny. Y'all see how nice Tony beard looks. So I always get so many questions about the beard butter that he uses and this is it. And I also bought some pumpkin pie spice. So I'm gonna just add that to the chai latte. And then we're gonna try to make it a little fancy and put some of this um, cocoa on top. So let's begin. All right y'all, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna just make like a little small sample first before making a big one and doing all the fancy toppings and stuff like that. I'm gonna use this pumpkin pumpkin pie spice. So I have okay. almond milk. Okay. okay. Let's see. Shake this up. And we're gonna just start off with a small amount first. So I'm gonna do a little bit of this. If we can put y'all on to something new, child. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I ain't nervous. I ain't never had a um, chai latte before. Okay, here. You do yours. Oh, I'm oh oh I'm making it. I thought I was the test. I'm like, huh? <laughs> <laughs> this first. Yeah. Okay. Alright, y'all. I'm gonna try this. It smells like it. Sweet enough though, y'all. Try it. It's good. Okay. So here's your drinks and it was really easy to make. So we use the classic chai latte, a little bit of the pumpkin spice syrup and the pumpkin pie spice, almond milk and ice. This is the only thing that I picked up from the antique shop. They had some really nice pumpus. 
So I just picked up these three right here. I'll probably end up cutting the stems because I just have them sitting in this little vase for right now. But they're so pretty. I haven't sprayed them down yet. But just look at the color. And I don't even know where I'm going to keep these. But they were so pretty. I could not leave them in the store. So um, they were three for 15. And they just look so good. I love them. They had all different types. So this was probably like the fluffiest ones that they had in there. But they look beautiful i love them so yeah i think i'm gonna burn my candle right now this is my little zen candle i got this candle from um either home goods or tj maxx because that's where i get most of my candles from but this one smells really nice so i'm getting ready to burn that please excuse my nails i have a nail appointment and i'll be getting my nails done soon so yeah so really quick, I showed my candle collection on Instagram. If you guys don't follow me, you should. I am Sharika B. So y'all make sure to give this video a thumbs up if that is something that you guys would be interested in seeing. And I'll do that for you. Excuse my little clamps right here. I have to clamp them on here because I lose them all the time. But yeah, I have a really large collection as you guys can see. So y'all just let me know if that is something that you guys would be interested in but um the reason that i showed my candles on instagram was because of the apple hold on let me sit down in this chair because of the apple pumpkin candle so you guys see this is the one that i love like this is the main one that i'm always after and um you see the packaging is different and to me this one smells the best um this one here smells like this one, but not as strong. And then the one that has like the little, I think it's back here. Yeah, this one right here, the one that has like the pumpkin top. Um, it smells nice, but it's it, it smells a little different. And I think it's because this one has the orchard apple, pumpkin, and cinnamon. So... These are just regular apple pumpkin. I did smell the one that was in Bath and Body Works today and no. <laughs> so it's this one here. If you guys can find this one where the packaging looks just like this with the red wax. Let me get one of these with the red wax Then grab this one. And um, it smells really good to me. Like this is my favorite one so I have a few so I'm set for this year for these and then this one is really nice too but like I said it's not as strong and this one has the white wax so yeah if you guys are looking I would either do these two here so that's that but y'all let me know if you guys would be interested in seeing a candle haul and I will try to get that video recorded for you. But you guys have to thumbs up the video in order for me to know that that's something that you guys want to see. Y'all know that I'm also obsessed with the sand and fog candles. I love the mango and tangerine candle and then the teak wood. Both of these are sand and fog candles this one is teak wood and then this one is the ocean mist and i'm not a fan <laughs> so yeah y'all let me know if that's something that you guys would be interested in